Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, in this video, me and two friends go cy uh, recycled to Derbyshire from Nottingham. Um, it's about a 70 mile round trip, about 35 mile there, 35 mile back, something like that. And uh, we're heading to a stretch of river that we've fished before. And we've caught trout of it, trout out of it. And uh, um, yeah, so basically we uh, catch a couple of trout in this video and we have a catch and cook. Um, we spend a couple of nights while camping. Um, a really memorable, memorable trip. Enjoy the trip. Before I forget, you'll have the chance to win this if you uh, follow me on Instagram. So uh, head over to that. I'll leave a link to my Instagram account in the description. Uh, so all you need to do is follow me, like the competition, and um, what's it? Comment and text someone in the comment. Uh, so if you're more familiar with these, it's a wasp. Unifox catapult, uh, really good for hunting, and uh, not that I know yet. I'm basically practicing myself, I'm just using this uh, time um, whilst we're isolated into uh, practice. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoy the video, and until next time, good hunting, bye bye. Let's go, man. Got miles to cut off. Definitely. All this struggling to keep up. Yes, boys. We go with my piece of music. Riding on my bicycle. What do you reckon? You don't end up like that, do you? Lucky roasting. It's not warmer than I thought, anyway. Well, I'm not taking it. Well, eat it, Steve. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> What do you reckon so far? It's <laughs> a lot further than I thought. Oh, really? It's kind of misleading, wasn't it? When we reached Derbyshire, you thought, yeah, yeah. we're there already. Nowhere near it, mate. My face is fucking freezing! It is cold, isn't it? Yeah. Mike has got some shit in his eye. So look, Mike, eh? First accident, Mike has got something in his eye. Thankfully, Mikey was able to carry on, and finally we reached the River Derwent. But the lad suggested we have another rest. We're probably about seven miles away from Matlock, if you can hear me. But we just sit by this river, have a rest, make it, innit? That's what you want me to do. Yeah. Rest your legs. Yeah. Rest is important. Well, we pushed on, stocking up on food and water as we passed through Matlock.
you don't see dancing that. Did you stop looking listening, Mike? Well, these are the yeah, half and half. <laughs> Don't what? Stop looking listen. We won't see. Fine, let's go. After carrying the bikes and the luggage over the two barbed wire fences, we find a nice spot against the river to camp. We pitched a tent behind an old brick building which sheltered us from the wind. <laughs> I had to put up a tent with Micah. Fucking, this is probably the second time me. Pick up putting up on your own. And there's Steve. Steve's crack. <laughs> what job, what crack, bro? Get him firewood. You're all right, aren't you? Yeah, I noticed I've that. I've done all this on my own. Took me two minutes. <laughs> Looking professional, me. Big grooves, still. Thought about my autumn bar, selling your pay right. I put it on my life. Chickens put me in position to donate the rice. Money. This is what it's all about. You're right there, dude. You're blinding your eyes. Yeah, it's this and I'm fucking toilet as well. Well, it's a bright start to day two. Last night was pretty cold, but we slept okay. Just gonna get our things together and cycle a few more miles to reach the River Wye. They're in my shoe. Yeah, man. Gotta keep your bikes up, you man. Yeah, definitely. Maintaining the bikes is key priority, isn't it? Here we're propping our bikes up with sticks which are in the shape of a Y. And this makes it easier for us to attach our equipment back to our bikes. Alright oh, Steve, good morning Steve. Good morning Steve. This is nice isn't it? No more tent. Back on the road. Cycle track. What do you reckon to the view? On the road again Just can't wait to get on the road again Steve's still going My love is making music with my friend I can't wait to get on the road again Report I just found that last four miles Not as fucking bad as yesterday yeah. Yesterday it was like it was in a rush down here Couldn't have time to enjoy the scenery or nothing Today It looks a lot more you're looking forward to seeing the fish, the trout. I'm looking forward to getting into the wilderness. Yeah. What do you reckon, Steve? What do you, what do you have to say? Freshly
travelled about five miles today to get to this like, this like point, about five miles. Caught one fish. First fish caught by myself. We had three or more on the line which got off. We had some cobs, ham cobs. Get one. We're gonna set up tent soon in this direction behind us. Are you ready to go fishing? See if we can get more foot trap. That's a swift move there, Mikey, as well. Fucking Lucky for us, Steve's going to call us a nice big brown trout. At least we're going to be eating more tonight. So whilst Mikey burns some wood for some hot coal, somebody's got the job of gutting the catch. Caught it, gutted it, seasoned it up, put some lemons in there, butter, put it in foil, and now we're gonna barbecue it. There we go. Yeah. Basically, cooking on hot coals. So, it's like a barbecue. 15 minutes. It's just a barbecue, but that. We're all trying a piece of the oh trout and lemon. God. This is a rainbow oh one. Oh my god! Out of ten, Steve. About nine and a half. Yeah. Oh, I bet you think it's pink. Oh my Mate. fucking day! <laughs> <laughs> is that yeah, nice? Man. It's fucking perfect. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. I told perfect. you I can cook. Right, I'm gonna put his camera down so I can get some. Get it? Oh mate, that is pink. Oh, that meat, bro. Perfectly cooked, bro, isn't it? Shame, bro. That stuff's nice, isn't it? This is finger licking good, but my fingers are dirty, so I'm not licking my fingers. Protein. <laughs> isn't it? <coughs> For the journey. Good oil. Well, that's it for now. We've cycled over 35 miles, camped over two nights to catch, cook, and eat some wild trout. Now. 